I'm Audronia Lepinaita, an assistant professor at School of Molecular Sciences. My lab is interested in three major areas. First, how RNA modifications affect gene expression in the neurons. Second, we are um, trying to understand molecular mechanisms of bacterial immune systems that are guided by RNA. And third, we are working towards designing novel precision genome editing tools based on these bacterial immune systems, specifically CRISPR-Cas systems. Today, I would like to talk about uh, precision genome editing tools and, and our progress towards designing a new generation of these tools. A multitude of uh, human gen uh, genetic diseases are caused by single point mutations. And these are very, very small changes which we need to fix in order to treat these diseases. And so there, are, there is a really pressing need to develop new uh, genome editing tools that allow us these very precise modifications. Currently, there are several CRISPR-Cas based uh, genome editing tools, so-called so DNA-based editors, that are able to introduce specifically these small modifications. However, these tools have um, several drawbacks, which we noticed um, in our previous work. And those drawbacks are such as DNA and RNA off-target editing, uh, quite low efficiency, and also modifying nucleotides which are next to each other. Now, we came up with four really inno innovative strategies for novel designs, which will provide us with a new precision genome editing approaches that address the limitations of current editing tools. To achieve our goals, we are using a variety of techniques and approaches, including cryo-electron microscopy, uh, machine learning, directed evolution, and rational design. Now, the tools which we, will be, uh, which we are developing uh, will have really broad range of uh, biomedical and bi biotechnological applications. They will allow us to understand the molecular basis of many genetic uh, diseases. They will also allow us to fix those diseases, so we could use them as um, as actual therapeutics. Moreover, these precision genome editing approaches uh, could be used for crop and livestock improvements. Uh, in the future, we are planning to use these precision genome editing tools to understand and treat neurodegenerative and neurological diseases.